Hello there, Golf Freak here, and welcome back to Let's Play of Mass Effect 3 with mods on Insanity as a Vanguard. Also, an Infiltrator, because I was just thinking about my Infiltrator for Uh, we last left off, we got a little mail. Uh. Find them in the crew manifest. There we go. This does increase. Oh, look at this. Cool. So we've got health and cooldown. These are minimal. This bot's pretty cool. You could basically, you know, fill up your ship with, uh, Personnel, which is legit. Anyway, we're gonna go take care of that bomb. <laughs> that seems a wee bit important. Um, I think having a robot would be pretty good for that. So the one thing about taking the the uh the people. From previous games is that they have no dialogue that's the only issue is they'll have no dialogue other than like orders and stuff so you got to bring at least one nah you know what screw it this is a good one My armor's still good. Of course, I gotta give you the locust. Because you're primarily gonna be using that, we'll just give you this. Some quick modifications. More and more points. Um, yeah, I think the additional enemies, I'm not sure how many people you can hold normally, and I'm not going to bother to check it out, but more control is always good. Oh, that's annoying. Just gives her everything. Automatically. Yeah, power damage. I don't know if I can reset her stuff either. Oh, Vettel. Normandy shuttle. This is Lieutenant Victus with the 9th platoon. Do you copy? We hear you, 9th platoon. We're approaching the bomb site, Commander. Getting bounced around pretty bad. This is as close as we get, Lieutenant. Look for somewhere to set your platoon down. Copy that. Talk to me about this Cerberus bomb. It's not Cerberus, Commander. It's... Turian. What do you mean, Turian? It was planted centuries ago, after the Krogan rebellions. The bomb was a safeguard against another galactic war. To keep the Krogan from becoming a threat. You won't earn trust with tactics like that. But right now, we focus on disarming that bomb. Yes, but Cerberus found it. Detonation means all-out war between my people and the Krogan. Right. Where is it? Those buildings ahead. Cerberus brought equipment to dig it up. The 9th platoon will cover your flight, Commander. With all this activity, the Krogan have to know something's up. Then we can't fail, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant.
Okay. Oh, she has a legit tat cloak in this one. That's interesting. I'll go ahead and do that. Ow. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got you there. What? Totally unfazed, by the way. The heck? Oh God. Oh God. My game does not like it when I do that. Oh, they're spawning here, how lovely. What the heck? Oh, and I got an explosion from that too. Love it if her thing recharged a little more quickly. Oh, it didn't go off in time. Awesome. This. This is going on for quite some time. Is it? Okay, good. I was gonna say, like, killed a lot of people. Oh god, what did I hit? Must have hit something. Ouch. Oh well, no actual damage. You can't stop me! Like seriously, you can try, I guess. Oh god. Oh no, that's not good. This is really bad. I got no way to get back fast, right? Yo! Chill with the rushing.
Oh god, he already got another turret up? This is not a good one. Let's see. Get you with this. Beautiful. That works for me. Okay. The Krogan rebellions were before my time, but I can't comprehend the need for this. I mean, it sounds like they almost lost, so... Short cool, 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 cool down is. Dead. He's gone. We're getting a lot of mortar fire. Heavy casualties. Taking alternate route. Circling around the bomb site. Copy that. Got a scope, I hope. Uh Yeah, it looks like I got that right. Waiting for you to pop. Ouch! Fancy roll. We'll have a better view up the ramp. Agreed. Let's uh. go. Oh, hi, dare. Oh, my dare. Oh, uh, I, 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 I said that, and I, I guess I made him go bye bye. Oh god, how'd you hit him over here? I can't believe it remained undetected. That's a bomb. It must have been far enough underground to stay hidden. Cerberus had to dig it out. We have to stop them. Commander, we're entering the bomb site. Moving towards the control station. Roger that. We're on our way. That's not the issue, methinks. I, methinks the issue is why they feel free to evacuate now. Control panel, Commander. 
Cerberus set up a firewall around the trigger mechanism to slow us down. I need to create a bypass. That'll take time. Like Control said, status normally set. I'm pretty sure that was just. Are you sure you can disarm the trigger? Yes, it's old tech. I know what to do. Buy me a few minutes, Commander. We'll make sure you have the time you need, Lieutenant. Understood. Starting bypass. And thank you for making sure I get this chance. Just make it right, soldier. Dope. Look out! Commander! Focus on the bomb. We'll handle Cerberus. Sniper shots? Okay, anybody over there? Nope, okay. What do we got? Hydra missile launcher over here, good to know. Oh my god, I took off with him still kind of inside. Wow, what hit me? You did? <laughs> oh my god! That hurt. Biotic explosions rack armor. Oh, yeah, me detonating that is so good. Probably could have waited until the shields went down, but whatever. Oh, jeez! Still up. You know what? Before I forget, let's do that. You know, the mission is probably over now. Commander, firewall down. Oh. Spirits. Cerberus hacked the trigger mechanism. It's set to detonate. Disarm it. No time. I have to separate the trigger from the bomb. Now! Cover me!
Time wise, you have to be getting close, right? Not sure what exploded there. Commander, I've got radio chatter coming in from Krogan Forces planet side. Sounds like they started sweeping out the remaining server's troops. Hate to be the guy who told the Krogan about that surprise package. Did you get out all right? Sounds like it got ugly down there. The Turians took a lot of casualties, Joker. The Primarch's son included. I can't count the times I've watched friends risk everything for a cause. To see the lieutenant die for us. For his platoon. It hits close to home. I'm getting tired of seeing people die. Especially when, like, I why can't, can't I just, like, biotic charge him? For a cause. <laughs> to see the lieutenant die for us. For his platoon. Didn't we just do this? It hits close to home. I don't want to lose good people either, Liara. I'm, I'm guessing because I have Kasumi in here and this is supposed to be a different line of dialogue and just triggered her twice. Good work on Tachunka, Commander. Stopping that bomb prevented the war between the Turians and the Krogan. We can't afford that kind of division right now. Joker said the Krogan are recovering the bomb. They moved in, won't allow Turians to send in recovery crews to help. Understandable. The situation is fragile at the moment. With Rex and the Primarch aboard the Normandy, you've got a situation brewing. We don't have a solid alliance between those two yet. Keep the peace, Commander. That's an order. Yes, sir. Pack it out. We couldn't risk another galactic war with the Krogan. The Genophage wasn't enough? You had to plant a bomb on my planet? The decision was made hundreds of years ago. So much has changed. Not enough to tell us about the bomb, coward. Hey! We can't let the past rip us apart. Working together, we have a chance. Primarch, you had a bomb on Tachanka. And Rex, in the Turian's place, you would have done the same damn thing. Shepard. It's over. His own son died today, making this right. Please, Commander. It's all right. Yes, fine. Shepard, you make your point. We have stronger enemies to face. We do. <clears throat> I understand your reservations before, Commander. But I hope you now understand the secrecy. I mean, it probably would have been better if there wasn't secrecy. <laughs> Secrets get people killed. You've learned that the hard way. Yes. The hardest lesson I'm ever to learn, Commander. Also, secrets can kill people. Like, they can save people, they can kill people. I mean, it kind of depends on the situation. So, that's kind of an unfair snap, but whatever. <laughs> My son. He died with the respect of his men. I wanted to thank you for that. His sacrifice will be recorded in the histories of the Ninth Platoon. Something any father would be proud of. Yes, sir. Again, Commander, thank you for ensuring my son died with honor. It's all a Turian father can hope for. Aside from him morning. not dying, Tomorrow I hope. Morning is later. Is there something you need? Despite everything, Primark, I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you, Commander. And I know I'm not the first to lose their son to this war. Needless to say, I'm committed to stopping the Reapers. That's all. Of course, Commander. Like, oh man, my father, you know, wants me to go and die in a war. 
That's okay. <laughs> Atarians pull another move like that, Shepard, and this alliance is off. Just bear with me, Rex. This is hard for all of us. I've got Reapers on my planet, a bomb that almost blew up my planet, and if those two fail, the genophage to make sure we all go extinct <laughs> okay. anyway. You lasted over a thousand years. I don't think the genophage is going to kill you anytime soon. Understood. They made it worse recently, like... Something you need? That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Anytime. Like, seriously, they made it worse recently. It obviously could not have been that bad. Don't exaggerate. Let me make sure I'm not missing a terminal or something in here. Up, oh, call meeting on cure. So this is a, from a mod, and this is really nice because now I can go do other things without forcing that mission yet. So Reapers don't have colonies. You can't bomb them or you're bombing what's left of your own tribe. I heard what you've got new messages, Commander. He was a brave man. Oh god, this is so jarring. Uh, there I go again. I was going to say that I could never do that. But being here watching you, you've shown me what it means to serve in the Alliance. You're a good officer trainer. Glad you finally realize it. Thanks. It's not that I'm volunteering for bomb jump duty. I'd suggest sending someone who has armor first, if possible. Look at that galaxy map. Do you know how many strategy games are built from that interface? You play strategy games? A few. Most are too flashy though. I prefer chess. I have a set made from rose quartz and hematite back home. I like the feel of something solid in my hands. Well, now that I know your weakness, we may have to try again. <laughs> It'd be more fun than playing Edie. Edie doesn't sweat. I'll s you sweat playing chess? Depends on how much fun we're having. Commander? Okay. All right. Husk, armament research, trainers. To create new if defense against them. Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. Because it's. Yeah, that's. It sucks, but. Yeah. They don't need husk corpses, is what it sounds like. They need actual corpses. It's kind of weird, but okay. The SUD deployed the enhanced variant of the colony. Variant of the house primary print, addition and increased size of frosty. <laughs> wow, 11% of the variant kills were their intended targets. The other 9% are calling this unfortunate team. The red house gave them the while. There's no need to put them down. The person do that job for us. We're not classifying them as success. Not to worry, we've not fully written off the project yet. <laughs> Whoops! Oh, wait a minute. A lone biotic worker intervened. Arash. Oh, oh, he was a service camp on project. Yeah, this is the guy that you can. This is the guy in Jack's mission that you that he's there that you can decide to spare or not. So he saved a bunch of kids. Wow, they kind of wrote that off as like not being very major in the background. But, uh,. Oh, call, uh, colonial support, huh? Don't worry, Edie. Once the Krogan are gone, we'll get rid of the smell. While this body has all factory sensors, I do not have positive or negative associations with any specific scent. Oh. Well, lucky you. <laughs> you gotta love the Turians. After they beat you down and sterilize you, they strap a big old bomb to your planet. You know, just in case you get uppity again someday. I'm just glad we disarmed it. Damn right. Krogan are pretty tough. I'd rather it be Reaper asses getting kicked and not ours. 
Commander? What's new, Edie? Admiral Anderson reports that the Reapers on Earth are broadcasting orders. They are demanding your leaders enter their superstructures in order to negotiate peace. Anybody aboard a Reaper is going to be indoctrinated. Exactly. This is a ruse to pacify the populace during that process. Citizens who are busy waiting are not busy fighting. It is likely that the governments of Earth will soon enact laws punishing those who attack the Reaper occupiers. Again, this will be done in the name of peace. Tell Anderson we're moving as fast as we can. Hello, Shepard. That's interesting. But I also don't know why they're even bothering, given how much freaking stronger they are. I mean, they could just orderly bombard everyone. I mean, I guess they do want the bodies. That could be part of it. But still, they're... Oh, I guess that's what's slowing it down. They're harvesting. They're not just killing. Probably. Anyway, I'm going to cut the video off here. Thank you very much for watching, and God bless.